Human Rights Watch has criticized the United Nations and the international community for their arrest campaign against the Houthis group, which targeted around 50 workers in organizations accused of being spies for the United States. The organization confirmed that the Houthis have a history of using detainees and forcibly disappeared persons as political bargaining chaps. The report stated that the United Nations agencies and organizations where the detainees worked did not make any efforts to contact their families, including those living abroad who could be reached safely. Human Rights Watch called on the Sultanate of Oman, which was a mediator in negotiations between the Houthis and other warring parties, to work collectively with other countries to ensure the release of detainees. The report also highlighted that since the end of May, the Houthi group has arbitrarily arrested dozens of civil society and United Nations employees without following legal procedures, which amounts to enforced disappearance. The organization confirmed that the Houthis did did not provide search or arrest warrants at the time of arrest, and the authorities refused to inform the families where the detainees were being held. Regarding the video clips broadcasted by the Houthis of detainees confessing of being spying for the United States and Israel, the organization said that there is a great risk that these confessions were extracted under duress and that publishing video clips of confessions undermines the right and lacks credibility in a fair trial. Human Rights Watch reiterated that enforced disappearances are serious crimes under international law and prohibited at all times.